Hello, it's Sarah from Tugger, here with another How To Connector video. Today we're looking at how to connect Harvest Forecast with Power BI, so let's run through it. So the first thing you're going to want to do is connect Harvest Forecast into your Tugger account. So log into your account and then click on Add Connector and then scroll down to Harvest Forecast and click Add Connector. Uh, in this screen, you can label it whatever you'd like to. So I'm just going to call mine Harvest Forecast and then click Authorize Access to Harvest Forecast and Authorize Application. So for this video, we're connecting to Power BI. So I'm going to select Power BI. And then on this screen, we have all of the information we're going to need to get these two things connected. So open Power BI and click get data. And we're looking for OData feed. It's then asking us for a URL. So if you click back to this page, you'll see the URL down here. You just click and paste it in there. And then we need to click down to basic and you've got to enter a username and password. So you go back to this screen and click next. And as you can see, your username and passwords are here. So just press copy paste that in, go back and get the password, paste that in. And then you'll also see on this screen that the drop down we want here is the slightly longer version. So if you go into this drop down, click here and then press connect. So this is going to pull through all of these different sources. Um, you can click as many or as few as you want. So we'll just click one and press load and then you'll be able to see it here in the right hand data column and from there you can do whatever you want with it so you can select whichever you need uh, create tables and yeah it's as simple as that i hope you found this tutorial helpful but if you have any questions whatsoever don't hesitate to get in touch with a member of our team who'd be more than happy to help you can also click the link in the description for a completely free trial of tugger don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel and we'll see you again soon.